called Brook Park, and it's part of the Green Thumbs program. And Green Thumbs was sort of created to deal with the community parks citywide because during the Giuliani administration, they tried to, um, uh, you know, get rid of a lot of community gardens, and then so laws were made that the uh, Green Thumb program was created to sort of protect them. But now that is expiring. And uh, the Parks Department is trying to put together new rules that doesn't protect the community gardens. Hmm. All right. So there's you know a need to protest that and make sure that uh, you know they're, com they're protected. Because then what happens is the the city will then take gardens and make them into housing projects. All right. Um, and without really regard for what the community wants. Is that what the city is really trying to do? A lot of times they try to do that. Well, there's always a competition between yeah. the need for affordable housing and the need for open space. And, yeah. and the need for luxury housing. Because a, lo a lot of those the ones that they did, com housing. see, the ones yeah. that they converted into supposedly affordable housing when they did it back when, yeah. are now all, all over $3,000 a month apartments. Yeah, that's, that's so it didn't, it didn't make it any more. It's a temporary yeah. thing designed to placate the yeah. community and it doesn't last. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. Around. Actual all section the, 8 housing, they don't build that. Have some things yeah. people buy from my Or I never find one community garden like in Brooklyn and here. Yeah. Yeah. See, this is this area right here is the, the, it's quite school, the big schools, one, yeah. the, like the different schools around here have little plots and they bring their kids in and teach them about, you know, sustainable agriculture. The community garden was that area over there, and there's little plots in the middle over there that we 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 actually have one. Um, if you, if you want to become become a community gardener, which is just somebody that volunteers, maybe has a plot, maybe helps just weed, or maybe just comes here once or twice a month, three times a month, they'll keep, have the place open, explain things to people. Every, then we all have keys. We all have keys to get into the, the garden anytime we want. We can use it for barbecues. We have bonfires. we got canoes we can take out and go out into the, uh, out into the river or Pelham Bay. So there's a lot of uh, fun that can be associated with the community garden as well as work. Yeah. And a lot of things you don't get normally in the city. It's like a big backyard. Yep, yeah. here. All right. Well, we love community gardens. And, so you're uh, always welcome. Thank you.